Hey guys, this is Adi from Local Outdoor. I want to make the thread here for my uh, on a barrel on my uh, Savage uh, Axis 2 bolt action rifle here. This is the bolt action rifle. So I want to make the thread in here. Uh, I try to find something in local, but they don't have the gunsmith in here. They don't provide service to uh, make the thread. So I have to do it myself again. I did it myself before and now I want to do it again. This is the Remington 223 calibers. So this will, I will create, make a half uh, by 28. So half inch by 28 thread. This is what I'm doing. So this is, uh, I hold this gun here. You can see it's all the way on the floor. Hold it in here. Make it, make sure that you put a uh, tape in here. I have the tape here. Tape so you don't want to scratch your barrel. And here I make this something like this. It's like an umbrella to uh, to capture all the debris uh, from here after I pile it. So you will need the piles. This is uh, I have the piles. You can see here the piles. Do you have it? And I need to pile this uh, a little bit, just to make it uh, easier when I make the thread. And you see here on my computer, the monitor, I have the size that what I have to uh, make in here around uh, 0 0.6 inches. And the diameter itself, if you see here, the outside diameter is a 0 0.4968. So I will create this about 0 0.5. So this are not too close to the uh, the maximum uh, outer thread. So the major diameter will still, uh, I mean, uh, the one that I left it is still bigger than the one that it needed. So if I uh, if I keep it before, it's almost uh, uh, the diameter is zero. Uh, 0.59 something is almost 0 0.6 so I will I, I cut this now I pile it I still need to pile it more and uh, yeah so far is looks okay I pile it myself just manually then after that I will need this threading tools this is the threading tools that I have and I used it before and this one is just different size right now it's this smaller caliber this one is a half inch by uh, 28 thread so that's all the tool i have don't forget these uh the di digital uh, measurement here the the gauge so it's showing 0 0.6 i just want to make sure this one is around 0 0.6 all over uh, all the way here so and then when uh, here I will make sure this one is about 0 0.5 so I need to adjust this first lock it and make sure you pile it equally almost equally if you because this is manual hard to uh, pile it equally you can measure it uh, but again is the uh, yeah it's the uh, it should be okay I guess uh, I did before and I know there's a lot of people don't like it when we do it manually uh, but I don't have a, a gunsmith, local gunsmith who can help me with this so again it's, uh, if you want to do it yourself it's up to you if not then you can send it if you don't have it in local you have to send it somewhere else and I don't want to send it somewhere else so I just uh, do it myself all right just uh, uh, thank you again for watching and uh, I will make a video all the process uh, I didn't make the process when I pilot but uh, at the beginning because I didn't think I'm going to make it again I already made once in my video you can find it and there's a lot of uh, pro and contra about that so all right guys uh, thanks again
So it's about 0 0.5, it's about half inch. Now I want to make, make sure that I pile it. It's not too, not too small. So it looks like it's almost there. It looks good. I need to work uh, on this more again. So once in a while, uh, I have to stop and measure it. And as you see here, I also uh, pile it on the top. So the top will be flat in here. You can see here. So see that, that I pile it. So just pile it around and you can feel it on your hand if you make a non-even uh, piles in here. So it looks like the surface is uh, smooth and uh, looks uh, even. So even this area is looks nice. Maybe I uh, pile it uh, more in this area. So I will do it again. I have a magnet here to uh, take out the debris here. So just put the tissue. This is the magnet. Wrap it like this and take it. So I can clean this up. Can you see here now? I get all the, uh, the particles here. Then you can just uh, throw it to the crest again. I already pile this, it's not really even. Uh, I need to pile this more, but uh, I think that's okay. Uh, now is the time to uh, make the thread. Uh, I'm using this guide. This guide, if you insert it here, so it help uh, help me when I make the thread. It will be uh, straight. So this this uh, guide uh, really helpful. So you can insert it in here from the top. I put insert it a little bit. There you go. So it's returning. And the gear that I use, this is the gear, uh, the oil. This is gear oil. I'm going to use it to lubricate this. That will be a lot of messy. Uh, there's a lot of oil drip. So I'm using this uh, tissue here. So I feel it's uh, getting wet. I will uh, put, in, uh, put it on the trash can. So if you see here, see that? So that's the guide is help. I'm going to give uh, oil first. Yes. Put oil here for the starter. I also want to put a little bit of oil here on the guide. Right, it's my napkin. Just insert it and turn it. Hopefully, it bite. So it bite, but don't push it hard. Just uh, turn it 
uh, counterclockwise a little bit and then right again a little bit. Counterclockwise and turn it again. We get a little bit more oil here. See the oil dripping. Make sure you tight it again. This always tight. it up again Check, make sure this one doesn't uh, help this uh, the thread. I mean, if this is holy, then it will break the thread. So I will take it off when I already have enough uh, thread created. So look like already have enough thread, but I need to tight this, tight this up. Sure. 
Also make sure the uh, the barrel is tight too. And continue. So the thread will be created already enough. So make sure we have enough lubricate lubrication in here. So lubricates once in a while. I use a lot of uh, oil here. That is okay. Just probably only the oil drip down here. But other than that, it's it's helpful. Nothing to worry if we use a lot of oil to help. All right, guys. I guess uh, this is enough. Let's check it out. Let's take a bit more. Okay. All right, you can see the thread is until down here. So that's good. Now measure it. So yeah, this is about uh, 0 0.6 uh, inch. So all of them. So that's good. So this is done for the threading. So thank you for watching. Let's see what uh, I will clean this up and see how this goes with uh, the muzzle brake or with uh, my any other uh, thing that I will going to put it here. All right, let me pause this uh, video and I'm going to wash my hand. I'm happy here. It just look really nice. Look at that. Look really good. <laughs>